Welcome back. In the crossfire tonight, an exclusive Democratic Party Chairwoman Debbie Wasserman Schultz and Republican Party Chairman Reince Priebus. Democrats like to complain about a Republican war on women. That was before Vice President Joe Bar Biden started his current tour of Japan. Today, while touring a Japanese game company, he walked up to a group of women and asked them, do your husbands like you working full time? He also asked them if they were married and whether they could work from home. <laughs> they seemed slightly confused. How do you explain Biden's inability to stay in touch with reality? I, I really think this is amazing that, that uh, you're bringing up the, Rep the Republican war on women in comparison to Vice President Joe Biden, the author of the Violence Against Women Act, when your party spent two years holding back on bringing the reauthorization of the Violence Against Women Act to the floor, when your party has nominated consistently the likes of Corbett in Pennsylvania, who famously said, well, if women don't like the fact that we're going to force them to have an ultrasound when they have an abortion, they can just close their eyes. Or the party of Mark Obenshain, who was the Republican nominee for attorney general in Virginia, who sponsored legislation that required a woman, after having a miscarriage, to report it to police. So if you want to talk well, about the war on women, Republicans, and, and that's just a couple of examples. There's, yeah, there's it, Walker it, it, in it's Wisconsin. It's interestingly selective. McDonald it's interesting in Virginia. No, I understand your version of reality. Let me just point out one example. <laughs> that's not a that's, version that's, of reality, Newt. Uh, that is, point. those You're are reality facts. reality for the Republican Party. No, no Corbett me, said that. Wait a second. Let me just point out one example that you had mentioned, you had alluded to earlier about treating cancer. In your home state, the most important cancer treatment center, the Moffitt Treatment Center in Tampa, has now been dropped by the AARP United Health Plan because of cuts that the Obamacare program made. So everybody who wanted to go there under those plans has now been excluded. You go around the country and talk about people who can't get cancer treatments. I would suggest to you that in many ways, Obamacare is a war on people with critical disease. Well, just wait until, the, wait, just wait until the employers start having the option of dropping the insurance coverage. I mean, if you think that things are bad now on the individual mandate, just wait until the employers and the businesses start dropping entire plans for all there of their employees. There are 37 employees. million people This is people going to be an un, it is, this is that didn't have drip, health insurance drip, at all. This is drip, drip that isn't going to go away. And the your, president made so a specific solution, promise. The president made a specific promise. Let me just finish. Not just that people could keep their insurance, but he made a specific promise that if people wanted to keep their high deductible their insurance, their ACME insurance, his exact words, that they could keep their insurance. Now that promise hasn't been kept. I, I Millions know, of people are getting their insurance question. dropped. You, you asked me and a so, question I mean, earlier, I have a question for you. Because your solution seems to be, is your solution, because you referred to that insurance companies to con are supposedly no, allowed. Let me ask one. you my question. I know what you're Insurance gonna companies are supposedly going to let people stay on their parents' insurance until they're 26. Is your solution that we should just trust, go back to trusting the insurance companies because they did such a First good job making sure everyone had access to so quality of affordable coverage? But secondly, no, what is I your think solution? my solution I want to know what is the Republican is, Party solution, is solution to quit lying to, to the sure, American people, no, 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 what telling is, them that they're going to keep their insurance when they can't? What about keeping their doctors? I have yet to hear, nor is anyone in the Republican Party said, is it true or what not? What is the solution to ensuring that everybody in America has access to quality, affordable health care? Because all you've proposed is repeal. That's not true. And no replace. There, first of all, this, this, this Congress has never How tried open everybody? pricing. This, this, this Congress has never, uh, never, open uh, never, never uh, proposed open prices, never pr proposed the idea that hospitals and doctors uh, put out the prices of the, the, the services and the, and, the, and, the, and the activities that they do in the hospitals and to their patients so that people can see what the prices are. No one, we have never tried so ending junk lawsuits. So uh, and and non-economic damages. We've never tried. Hang on, you asked me. To, you asked me the question. I'm going to answer it. We've never tried small businesses and individuals uh, being able to pool resources together so that more people could get access yes, and that have, prices could be driven groups. down. But what you didn't want to put that. Small, you didn't want to sit down three years insurance. ago and put that into into we, the bill. There are you many states across this country, Ryan, that have small group health insurance. But we have. We've never. We haven't tried open. Are you saying that around this country we have a federal law that allows open pricing and individual pricing right now? And maybe we should. Open that. pricing right now? I want where to jump in here. That We've brought... ended junk lawsuits. Where's, where's, where's the, the legislation? We straight to That's Obamacare. something that we should consider. Well, thank However, you. it doesn't actually solve the problem That's of right. people being locked but, out of coverage. But, your but I want to change. Is to leapfrog it doesn't from, prevent people from being your, dropped from Your solution or denied is to leapfrog directly either. to European Obamacare. Oh, come on. That people right. don't no, like. Right. 
and people are getting <laughs> dropped. You're the and one people that just are not, then said to stop and, lying. Right. So oh, the so I want to actually I want to change. You keep your doctor. Was that a lie? You. Was that a lot? Launched a, a huge. Oh, the Affordable Care Act is private market health insurance. So people aren't going to lose are, their doctor. You, no, people are not. So when they drop, when they get their insurance dropped, they don't lose their doctor. People will lo not lose their doctor any they more won't. than the current system in which year to year people, millions people of people weren't coverage. losing their insurance under the current system. Are you going to tell, tell me they absolutely by the hundreds yes, of thousands? Yes, oh, they were. Yes, absolutely. Every, every year. single oh, year. Every Within year. three year. weeks. We can do a whole tutorial right. about the, the really. system that you want to go back to because you know. What? Nobody was happy you're with saying it. That, you obviously you're do not saying understand that, how the health insurance system works. Well, obviously you don't understand it employer, because you're the one that so promised often, now, see, so that people often, would keep their employ, health insurance and me. you promised that people would keep their doctor. So often, but it turns out that it's employers not Employers have to change so maybe out you their are entire the one insurance that needs policy. to learn no, what, what, I what the effects is are that of now Obamacare and health care system. Who didn't have access to health insurance before now do. And what about the millions of people like me on January 1st? who previously had to worry about the other shoe dropping if we had a reoccurrence of a pre-existing condition, have the peace of mind knowing that that can never happen to us pre again. And you you're, and your you're, party you're taking would re one issue, that. which is pre-existing conditions. It's a pretty and you're applying issue. it to the entire concept and of you, Obamacare. And that's it exactly Republicans what it is. have and supported no the idea of covering pre-existing conditions. That. There's no replace. There's We're only go back to the old system and let people fend okay. for themselves. Okay.